Good morning, everyone. Good morning. It's 6.18 a.m. We're going to the station because we are going to... Venice. Yeah, with Chris, he's getting ready. I'm tired. <laughs> oh, no, tired. No. But I'm very excited about Venice because it's one of my favorite cities in the world because it's unique. Only we have Venice in Italy. Okay, let's go. Ciao, good morning. We're headed to Venice today to <laughs> check out this beautiful world. Going with Brian, Sonia, we gotta go take the metro to the train. And then we have about a three and a half hour train ride down to Venice. Once we get there, we're gonna go sightsee, possibly try some food and just check out the area. We're all looking forward to it. We'll Thank check you guys you. out in a little. We'll see you on the train. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Guys, I was thinking that even though I look Italian, I'll be speaking English all the time in Venice. I'll be more exposed to pickpocketers because they will think that I'm a tourist. I need to be more careful. I even have a backpack, which is not a good idea when you go to a place like Rome or Venice. If you're not from Italy, I'm giving you a tip. All right, guys, we arrived early. So we're waiting for the train and we decided to have breakfast. I let Chris choose and guess what he chose? <laughs> Probably you're thinking like, Sonia, you're not a good host. You should have stopped him. But you know what, Chris has been here for a few days and I'm sure he misses his American food. And I was like, it's all right, we're going to Venice. He can have some McDonald's. Let's see. Let's get it. <laughs> I mean, yes, subscribe the vlog, but the vlog is not over yet. What's up, YouTube? I got these cuties. We're just loving life. Guys, currently waiting on Sonia and Chris, and I noticed that to pee, you have to pay a euro. That's the most expensive pee I've ever had. Interesting. Starving and we had lunch at the station even because eating in Venice is really expensive and I bought the most elegant bottle of water I've ever seen they had pizza I mean nothing special but we were hungry after that we took a train and in 10 minutes we were in Venice we're in Venice we're like screaming without screaming I'm here beautiful it's a beautiful day as well. I'm so glad that I'm vlogging. I don't like seagulls. Shut up. Because once, five years ago, I was in Venice and I saw a seagull that killed a pigeon. A poor pigeon. He was eating it. It's a sort of bird cannibalism. They're aggressive. Sorry, seagull lovers. That's crazy. Why? It's just the street ends and it's water. You think it's crazy? Yeah. Would you like to live in Venice and have your own personal boat? That'd be cool. It's so cool that Chris likes to see all the little streets, like explore. I'm glad he's liking Venice and I feel that he really is. He's always like filming and taking pictures. Swerving, how you look so thirsty on your birthday. Swerving, think it's me and maybe Thursday. And in person, I'm on your body, make you nervous. Fuck you from the back and leave you turning. <laughs> okay, Chris just found a very small alley, so he's like, we gotta go there. <laughs> the thinner, the cooler for Chris. 
walked into that, I saw water, it was cool. I love Rome, Rome is my city, but Venice, guys, really beautiful too. I didn't say more, but I said too. Love it. Christina, do you prefer Venice or Rome? Rome. Just because you're in it, but if you weren't there, I'd probably prefer Venice. This is a perfect answer because I can't get mad at him because he says something nice, but also pretty much he said Venice. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys. Well technically it's still like 4 in the afternoon. I took a nap because I was very tired and I still am, but I'm feeling better. Plus homeboy here is a little hungry. He's been complaining because he's hungry. What's Gucci? We better go get pasta. Yep. It's like the million picture Chris asked Brian to take in Venice. Guess how many pictures he wanted in Rome? One at the Colosseum. Alright guys, we wanted to have a snack. And you know me, it's not like I can just Stop watch eating. people eat and yeah. I ended up eating more than everyone plus the owner of the shop gave us one extra plate of pasta and now it's 5.15. I don't think we're gonna eat dinner anytime soon. I don't know what we'll do. No, seriously. I can't believe I had dinner at like 5.30. Really? I mean, it was good, but I wanted to sit down. Fully indulge in the moment, in the vacation. Take a look around and be like, I am dining in Venezia. But it's not too late. Maybe we can go grab a beer and a little aperitivo type thing. But yeah, maybe like a dessert later. A little hot chocolate, a little gelato. We ended up walking around for the rest of the night. I had a dessert and they had a beer. Guys, I'm really, 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 really cold. So we're just going to our hotel. It's like eight. We feel like it's midnight. We so woke up okay. at five, it's justified. It is, I think. It's whatever. Tomorrow, day two in Venice. Scrabble. Scrabble, dab on them. Ciao, buonanotte. Peace. Bye.